we're making a quiche, but a vegan version, which you might think is impossible, but you'd be wrong because we have tofu. Shall I show you what I do? Well, I don't think people know how to cook it. It's like, have you ever touched a dog's tongue? No, but I can imagine. Uh, what are you doing? You do this with tofu. I'm getting yeah, the moisture out. Yeah, you're taking out the moisture. Yeah, and then you put it in the blender. In this quiche, the tofu is like the main mixer of happiness. I do eat a lot of quiche because I visit a lot of garden centres. <laughs> is that like the choice of weapon? Yeah, yeah, it's like going to Italy and not having pasta, isn't it? Yeah. Don't go to a garden centre without a quiche. All right, so now what am I doing to this bit of foot in the in the blender? Right, now this is the secret ingredient. Nutritional yeast. It looks like fish food, right? <laughs> it smells like it as well. How much do I put in? Half of it. Half? Of the whole thing? Yeah. Are you sure? Cheesy, nutty flavour, and that's what we want. I'll put a little bit more for <gasps> you. Oh, I wouldn't put that much in. <laughs> Lucy ain't holding back on the flavours, so it's time for hella turmeric. You always put half of the turmeric in there. It's just balanced then, isn't it? Some onion granules. What'll happen is you won't taste anything but the yeast flakes, so... Yeah, <laughs> that's what you want. Blend it all together with some oat milk and then bang in some fresh basil. There you go. Growing up, was there any food your mum used to make for you? When she was a bit skint, she used to get everything out the bottom of the freezer and she would say, oh, this is tapas. This is what the Spanish do, and they'd be like a turkey drummer. <laughs> like spring rolls, but there's yeah. just two spring rolls left. Made yeah. from the frozen food in the freezer. Stuff at the, the bottom of the freezer, yeah. In a separate pan goes some spinach and some cherry tomatoes. Hey. Woo. That was good, one. The sea salt. A lot of salt, it's that. Not, it's sea salt, oh. so it looks like it's more. My God. <laughs> I'm going to wake up in the middle of the night gasping. Has food ever given you mad indigestion? Yeah, I was hospitalised for eating a burrito. How do you go to hospital for eating a burrito? I was very, very pregnant. The burrito and the baby was having a battle for room. But I feel sorry for John, because when we got to hospital, I burped and I was all right. I sort of knew then, to be honest, that it was indigestion. Yeah. But they were so nice with me, and I had to go along with thinking, so I said, there's something really wrong with me. <laughs> OK, maybe sit to tacos if you're ever pregnant again, Lucy. Back to the quiche, flinging that wilted spinach and tomatoes into the tofu mix. Ugh. So are you actually vegan all the time, like? No, I do like yeah. a bit of chicken or, you know, a bit of steak. <laughs> John's the best vegan I know because he really misses me. Yeah. And it's instead of having an affair, so well, you're basically cheating on him? Oh, yeah, I go to a hotel room and the first thing I do is pick up the room service and order a steak. But then it all gets a bit weird because he knows I'm going to do it. But then they're like, oh, what did it taste like? Was it nice? Was it tender? <laughs> <laughs> and the quiche mix goes into a pre-baked pastry quiche base. Never said quiche this many times. I feel like I'm going to play some croquet and watch bowls. I like cheap crisps. Like what kind of cheap crisps? Oh, I'm talking real cheap, like Space Raiders. <laughs> Yeah. Pickled onion ones. Yeah, I like all of them. I used to bang that still. 20p, what do you mean? I buy, buy six for one pound. Whoosh! Now we'll place some tomatoes on top. <laughs> OK, um, great presentation there. Yeah, nice. Bet in the middle like that. It looks like an island now, doesn't it? Yeah. That's lovely. Food should be art, shouldn't you? Because you see it with your eyes first. I get it. Food is art. Bang that in the oven to get bakey for 30 minutes. What's your type of dessert? My favourite dessert is apple crumble. OK. Do you like apple crumble? I love it. Do you like it with ice cream? No, I like it with custard. Would you like it hot or cold? Hot. Hot? Yeah. And how much custard? A lot? Well, I want it in a jug as well. Don't pour it on for me, because I don't want it to go on the crumble and make it soggy. It needs to be on the side. Yeah, in a jug. In a big jug, ready. Yeah, yeah, yeah. OK. I feel like I'm understanding you a little bit more in terms of your food game. Are you a good cook? When I cook, Try to ask my ancestors to guide me. Yeah, I do that. I channel my inner Sierra Leonean ancestors. Cos I'm good with fish. I'm an instinctively good cook with fish. We're from a long line of trawlermen. Like deep sea fishing and them thing there. Yeah, I know how long to do fish fingers without checking. And, you know, I can debone a fish with my teeth. What? <laughs> 